user WWE fan Hardy Boys. This question basically was just asking what should we do for someone that is skinny fat and wants to cut. Now skinny fat is usually associated with someone who could be an ectomorph, someone who is usually skinny and may even have a calorie deficit that they follow, but they lack the muscle mass. So they have very little muscle mass and striation tissue. So they actually look fat instead of just skinny. Sometimes you'll see someone that is really skinny. You know, you see their ribs and you know how I used to be a long time ago, 118, booyah. But you'll see that and you'll say, wow, that person is skinny. And then at the same time, you can see that exact type of build and body frame, but due to them not exercising at all, and accumulating body fat percentage, they still have the same weight as person A, but this person B, actually, you perceive them as being fat. Now, I wrote some notes here, let's go over them. Already went over. Um, they look skinny, but they have body, high body fat percentage. Next thing, low muscle mass, we already went over that. And this is quite possibly someone who doesn't have an optimal calorie intake, so they could have a, de a deficit calorie intake and with that deficit they're losing the remaining muscle mass because the body is trying to have the energy it needs to go day to day and when you're in a calorie deficit the body oftentimes will go to the muscle break the muscle down to give it some fuel and energy and that will in this case make you have even less muscle visibly showing so you'll look just skinny but fat at the same time that's why they call it that now this is some ways that you can fix this okay strength training combined with high impact interval training which is cardio where you do maybe 20 minutes really fast and then a break and then 20 minutes really fast example okay you're not just going at a high pace you're going really high short break really high short break now what this does is you'll be able to lose the body fat percentage through the high impact interval training cardio that you do. And if you do strength training as well, you'll be able to put on the muscle mass. Now, it's simple in theory and it's pretty simple in execution, it just comes down to the individual themselves. So, high impact interval training, maybe like two or three times a week for 45 minutes, see how that goes. Strength training, you wanna do compound lifts, you know? So you can do bench press, back squat, barbell rows, front squat, pull-ups, the core essential compound lifts, and that will allow you to put on the muscle mass and to also lose the body fat percentage. And now if you notice that your body fat percentage isn't dropping or you're not looking like more muscle is being visible, then maybe increase the, the cardio and decrease the time on the strength training. Either way, make sure that your diet is in check. That's the most important thing. In this case, if you're trying to gain muscle mass but lose body fat at the same time, you wanna make sure you got a slight calorie surplus enough to maintain the new muscle mass that you're trying to build. So, that's it for this episode of Ask Lloyd. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please like, share, give it a thumbs up, especially a thumbs up since I'm not wearing my glasses. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Remember to be the change. Take care.